Hey guys, so uh, I got a request here to do a speed test comparison between the Xperia Z3 uh, and the Nexus 5X here on the right. Uh, so basically we can see here if the old Z3 can keep up with the new device. Uh, it's running uh, Android Marshmallow, uh, which I have flashed on through a ROM, uh, the Zing CoS ROM. So uh, we can just uh, boot them both off here at the same time and see how they power off. So no messing around for the Z3. Still a very beautiful device. And uh, booting on. So obviously uh, the Z3 coming with Snapdragon 801 versus Snapdragon 808, 3 gigs of RAM in the Z3 versus 2 gigs of RAM. And you can see boot up here very nice and quick. And as someone has mentioned actually the screen on the Z3 is a million times better really in terms of the luminosity, colour gamut and just uh, everything really uh, some people don't like their displays cool and you know the Nexus 5X is a little bit warmer in terms of display but I'm telling you this is a beautiful display still on the Z3 uh, at least according to my eyes uh, but nevertheless uh, I can just quickly show you the setup here so basically this is running very uh, stock like Android 6.0 and we're running the latest uh, updates as well. Do get an update on the Nexus 5X um, Android security patch level of November, which is nice that they keep it up to date like that. Uh, but nevertheless, how do they compare? We can have a look here. Everything's closed down in the background pretty much. So the Z3 starting off very well here. A draw on these two. Nexus 5X coming back now, 1-1. One, one. 5X again, 2-1. 3-1. Three two uh, so that was quite similar. Didn't really notice too much of a difference there. What about the button? Three two one. Oh, wrong one. Hang on. Three two one. Button not working on the Z three. That's weird. It worked on the last video I made. <laughs> Why is that not working? That's a re really weird, but nevertheless, it's not a huge issue. Uh, we can move on to uh, YouTube. Think quicker here on the right again, only just though. Uh, Play Store. Quicker here on the left, I think that time. Very nice. Uh, settings, about the same. Dialer. Where's your dialer at? Maybe the Z3, but not a huge difference, really. So, you know, you can see here, I think the actual performance is quite mixed, really. Uh, I think the Nexus was dominating on quite a few of them though, more than I thought. So probably, you know, the Nexus just, just kind of clinched it. But then again, it doesn't seem to be a huge difference here really, uh, if I'm to be honest. So 
very nice uh, speed you're going to get on the Z3 considering it's a year and a half old. So we just uh, move on now to the web browsing component. Both of them support the the um, 5G. Let's try that again. So very quick here on the right, which is nice. GSM. And again, the right here. Wow, new high-end HTC. X9 2K display. Wow. That looks interesting. It might uh, motivate me to buy it, unlike the A9. Uh, the Verge. So I think you can see here the uh, Nexus 5X, a very nice fast performance when it comes to your web browsing against the former flagship here. One more, Phone Arena. And again, the Nexus just clinched that then. Spun. Let's try that again. Quicker here on the left, but too little, too late. Z3. I was expecting you to own the Nexus 5X here, but it's not the case really. Uh, Uber. So this is the multitasking component. So straight away it looks like the the um, Z3 is a little bit quicker here, quicker with the keyboard. I forgot to open a game, so let's just uh, quickly do that so we can multitask into it. Wow, so the Z3 went into this quicker. Very nice game load speed there. And we can just continue with the multitasking. Reload on the left. I want to see that. Quicker reload on the left. Both of them, you know, reloading here a little bit. Very similar for the camera there. Not a huge difference. Wow, reload on the right. So that two gigs of RAM clearly constraining it now. And Play Store. Uh, let's go back into the game. Quickie here on the left. So I think the multitasking probably that little bit quicker on the Z3, which is uh, interesting. But then again, it does have the three gigs of RAM, uh, which shows it's still very relevant here. You know, you probably get the Z3 for the same price or cheaper than the 5X, and I'd probably support you getting the Z3 any day of the week. Uh, but that's just my opinion, you know, and I uh, hope you uh, enjoyed the video. Uh, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.